racing. Shahoud is one of the first away near the inside from Cherub, who's held up in the early stages out uh, deeper on the track. Two is Mazarayon as they sort themselves out. Also, Tark is not that far away either as they settle down. In behind the leaders, Veltar, and then made in Japan in that striped jacket back at about 10th position near the inside, one out from the fence. Out very deep with a white cap is uh, Humid Climate. And Howl Hill is the one with the red cap, yellow jacket, about fourth last. Coming to the first, they jump nine, and they're stretched across the track. Some Cat cleared that in company with Tark, and also right up there as well is a Shahood over on the far side. Near side is Meza Rayon as they come to the second. Cherub in the green and white jacket getting through on the inside. In behind that leading group two is uh, Tusk out deeper on the track from No Pekin. Further back in the field is King Revo as they come now towards the third. And they're right across the track. Six in line here. Reading from the inside, Cherub there in company with Shahood. Out deeper on the track is Mazarayon. Then right in the centre, Veltar from Sun Cat and Tusk is out deeper on the track. They're followed further back by Tark who's right up there as well. In behind that leading group at this stage is made in Japan. Pan snookered on the fence in about 7th or 8th position as they swing sharply left-handed now, leaving the home straight. Uh, made in Japan, just a bit short of room there. Out wider on the track too is uh, Al Aller as they make that turn from My Will in centre field. And then on the inside of runners as they head towards the back is Dalaran. Out deeper on the track then Hal Hill, followed then by Adopted Hero as they head into the back. King Revo as well back as well, giving them a start. First one down the back. And uh, for the back in the last position is Aramero heading down the back of the course now and off the track here it's uh, Tark who just shows the way Tark over on the far side from on the in the centre Mesereo uh, there followed as they come towards the fifth by uh, Shahood that's the one two three then Cherub just in behind them as they clear that well Suncat is right on their heels as well but it's Tark deep off the track is just the leader made in Japan in the striped jacket running about fifth or sixth at this stage and getting right up on the inside now is Dalaram as they clear the last one down the back and Hal Hill hit that one pretty hard but as they head down the side now it's Tark the leader Tark is just the leader from Shahood. They're a half length in advance of Sherub and further back in the field then is Mazarayon who's losing ground now. Made in Japan is now starting to make ground and no peeking around the outside as they sprint across the top of the track. Cherub is just in behind the leading group here followed by Dalaram. Further back then is Veltar as they come towards the turn from Al Ala, Hal Hill and then adopted hero uh, held up on the inside. They swing the corner now and it's Tark on the inside just the leader from Made in Japan. Over on the far side, Cherub in third, followed further back in the field by Shahood as they make the corner. No Pekin is now starting to draw, come into it as well, and Al Aller on the near side is going well. At the third last, and made, made in Japan heads for home now. He's two lengths in front of No Pekin. Al Aller coming there stylishly on the near side. They've kicked right away now uh, from Tark as they clear the second last. It's Made in Japan, just the leader from Al Aller, who now switches to the inside. My Will is now coming home with a wet sail and no peek in behind them. But it's Al Ala on the far side moving up to Made in Japan. They jump the last almost together. It's Made in Japan on the near side. Far side is Al Ala. They're fighting it out with 100 yards left to go. Near side Made in Japan grabbed by Al Ala who's going home the better. There's the Irish Raider on the far side for Timmy Murphy. Gets up to win it. Al Ala wins it well. From in second Made in Japan. A gap of eight lengths into My Will. Followed further back then by Tark and they were followed by No Pekin and King Revo back in the field then Cherub and further back Howl Hill the rest finishing in a, a bit of a bunch there looking further down the course you can see that uh, Human Climate pulled up but the winner for Ireland is number four Al Alla on the inside punched right out to the line by Timmy Murphy gets the money here from Made in Japan a good performance number four Al Ala owned by M.A. Ryan trained by John Queerley and written by Timmy Murphy second number two Made in Japan owned by Terry Evans trained by Philip Hobbs written by Richard Johnson and third is number 12 My Will owned by Mrs. Judy Stewart and Andy Stewart trained by Paul Nichols and written by Ruby Walsh and fourth is number 16 Tark Sam Thomas who was there for so much of the journey but that is a game winner.
came there very strongly, three out, switched to the inside by Timmy Murphy. He could see that uh, uh, Made in Japan just getting a bit weary, and uh, two good horses, they've drawn right away from them. Al Alla, good if you had it, 25 to 1. Timmy Murphy coming back after his 52nd winner of the season. Well, Timmy Murphy made, made a fantastic move on El Ella, and at this point you can see that uh, the horse is <laughs> pretty much under pressure, but uh, Made in Japan, who is the eventual second, is, is slightly ahead, and they are the two that fight this out. Richard. Yes, and as we run it, what I want you to watch is Timmy Murphy back in sixth or seventh place, just giving the horse a reminder to get it running. He's on the wide outside at the moment, but he makes a masterly move in a minute and switches to the inside and gets the rail. Now, especially for younger horses, Skew, if they've got the rail to run straight, keep your eye still on the left of the picture as we watch now, and it's after this hurdle. Made in Japan has risen first there, El Aller is just in behind, and Murphy says, I'm going for the rail. Look here, now, he made a decision. To me, that was the winning decision. Yeah, it helped, obviously, a great deal. I mean, I thought that the bit about me to Murphy turning into the straight was where he whacked his horse, he got him up on the bridle so he could jump those three into the straight well. And he's got him running and he didn't really pick his stick, stick up again till now. I think Richard Johnson, in his horse, is leaning a bit on uh, LA there. He would like to have pulled his stick through and might have got another run out of him, but a great run by Made It Japan. I mean, to me, Timmy Murphy tactically is a supreme jockey and astuteness, he's right out of the Carla Wellin bag of tricks of astuteness in race riding. He's a superb rider. We've had three rides, that's the ride of the meeting so far for oh. me. No, Tony McCoy. Well, I have to say I agree, no. agree with Richard. I, think I that just was don't like